Really excited about the way our guys played. We had a slow start and struggled with our option. They made a, a third down and nine, uh, or third and ten with the option, and had another situation where they came up and made a, a third and nine uh, throwing an out. So they, they stayed on the field the first half. They had the ball about 20 minutes to our ten. Uh, we only had the ball six plays the first quarter, uh, and it, it really lulls you to sleep and takes the crowd out of it and gets your guys struggling a little bit. But I thought the, the score before the half was key, and then we came back out and scored to start the third quarter and, and then took the game over. Uh, but like last week, I think they've got a pretty good offense and got some things going. Um, defensively, we blocked a punt, returned a punt 35 yards, uh, forced a couple of turnovers, which were key. Um, only lost one turnover, I think, from our standpoint. We only punted once, and it was 51-yard punt. Uh, so I thought we dominated the kicking game. We still did a great job covering kickoffs, and, and uh, they're kicking them really, really well. Hate that we missed the field goal, but I thought both young kickers did better and the snappers did better tonight, and that was headed in the uh, right direction. The, the best thing about tonight, it, it was a fun game for the whole team. Everybody got to play. Uh, when we didn't put our foot on the gas and, and finish the game at 31-9 to nine last week, in the second half, we dominated the second half, and everybody got to play and enjoyed it. it makes your football team better. Morale's better. Kids are happier. Mamas are happier. Uh, everybody's happier, and 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 you get better as a football team because you gain more depth. And I was glad that the uh, uh, the second and third time the third team defense uh, uh, kept them out of the end zone and got a shutout. Challenged them to come up with explosive plays. You felt like you saw some some of that. Tonight. We did. We still need more, but we're headed in the right direction, and and we'll. Uh, uh, we're still working to get more speed on the field and make sure we get speed in space and and um, get some explosive plays. And that's 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 our key right now. Tonight was a night where we had the best team and it was never in question. And we were able to look at a lot of different guys and a lot of different things. Glad that Case got to play a quarter in some. Glad that MJ McFarland caught a touchdown pass. Glad that DJ uh, Johnson caught a touchdown pass. So uh, a lot of guys, Jonathan Gray, carried it a lot more than Malcolm Brown. It, it was a night to work on things, and, and I thought we got a lot of guys looked at that, that needed to, to get a look. The schedule sets up perfectly for us going to Ole Miss because you, you play against Wyoming, and it's a four and five wide out uh, pass attack, and, and you play against New Mexico, and it is an absolute triple option offense. And Ole Miss is going to be a combination of both, so we've gotten enough option work tonight. We sure don't have to work on it again for the rest of the year. Uh, and then we've got uh, uh, we've, we got uh, a lot of the passing attack, and I don't know how Ole Miss came out tonight with El Paso, but um, but that'll be an exciting game for us.